What's going on, boys and girls? I think I'm live. I guess I am. Uh, video number two for the day, as promised. Uh, earlier, I woke up, and on my radar came in a video about the bees, okay, and what they're doing, because all the bees around the world are dying, okay? Now, for all of you that were born way back when I was, I remember as a kid that, man, there were just, dude, there were bees all over the place. I mean, the dandelions, flowers, I mean, but you know, we always seeing bees, millions of them all over the place. It was nothing, I mean, to go throughout the day and see a million bees, literally. Uh, but I don't even see them anymore. In fact, it's been that way for years. I mean, I rarely see any bees anywhere, you know. I see a couple yellow jackets here and there, and that's it, man. I mean, the honeybees, yeah, they're gone, man. I mean, I rarely see any whatsoever. Uh, so anyway, this video, 60 Minutes, is addressing the problem in Australia. Okay? So you watch the video down below. I'm going to put it down below. It's actually it's good, it's a good video if you want to learn a little bit about what's going on. But here's what uh, struck me. A couple things struck me okay number one you know what they're doing with these bees they're putting little microchips on the backs of these bees okay they just take a pair of tweezers and they're taking thousands of bees and they're putting little microchips on them so they can track these bees no matter where they go no matter where they fly no matter how far they go doesn't matter okay they can track these bees now, years ago, they started putting these things into cats and dogs, but it was where you had to scan the neck of the cat or the dog, supposedly, you know, to get the information off the chip. Now, they have little chips that can fit. They're, they're very, very small. They can fit on the back of a bee. They're, they're that small. And they can track these bees no matter where they go. I mean, 100 miles away, 200 miles away, satellites, whatever whatever they do, no matter how they do it. But isn't that amazing? Now, for all you biblical people that understand what's going on, you know where I'm going with this, right? Uh, sure you do. Track you, you know, these little chips will soon be able to control your money. They already do. They already do. It's already, it's, it's already in the works. Uh, so there you have it controls everything they can monitor control they know exactly where you are where you're doing they can even probably hear your voice what you're saying the whole nine yards can you imagine that kind of power that your government and your states and your local satanic authorities would have if they could just literally know everywhere you're at every penny you spend and every word you say wow man wouldn't that be something that's dude that's that's the holy grail for these demons. This is what they want. This is what they're going for. And it's biblical. It's going to happen. We all know that. But I found that interesting. Now, another thing I found interesting in the video, if you pay cl close special attention, these bees, okay, uh, the company that is, you know, doing work with the bees, okay, it's called the National Center of Engineering Agriculture, and their symbol is a pyramid, okay? We all know what that means. The little, the little demon gang symbols are the pyramids, and they got their own, you know, sides and symbols and numbers and all that good stuff. The Illuminati, whatever you want to call it. Uh, so it's a pyramid, okay? So now pay attention. The Center for Agricultural Engineering, basically the same people, okay? Their symbol is the phoenix rising okay it's a it's a big it's a big circle with a phoenix coming up out of it i found that very interesting for all you uh people that know what that means uh, if you don't figure it out another gang sign another gang symbol from the demons that run this world um anyway i'm gonna put the video down below check it out guys very interesting it really is the bees have disappeared. I mean, I used to look out here at the grass, you know, and I would see them, millions of them. I mean, dude, you had to, you had to run. You know, I don't know how many, how many times I got stung, you know, once a week almost. There were so many. 
and you just don't see them anymore. But anyway, all right, watch the video below. But uh, very interesting with the chip and how far it's coming along, you know, and how it's, it's already here. I most definitely. All right, peace out. Take care. God bless.